Okay, so today I'm going to show you how to take the barrel out of an FX Wildcat. Uh, this is a Mark II, so it does have interchangeable calibers, but we're not going to go over that today. Um, whenever you change the caliber on a Wildcat, there is uh, quite some specific tuning you do, and you need to make sure the measurements are right back here. Um, so we're not going to go into depth that day. That will be a much, uh, much later future video. Uh, so today I'm just going to go over the removal of the barrel. So, you have to remove your cheek piece first. You got to move these two top screws. They are both uh, three millimeter. So you're just gonna back them out. There you go, you can move your cheek piece. And then you actually only have one set screw, and then the uh, once again for the transfer port, the uh, the plug hole or the, the plug screw. So just once again, uh, you make sure that this is not tightened down uh, so they cannot remove the barrel. It is a four millimeter. So there you go. I just backed out about half a turn on it. So here we have the set screw for the barrel. Uh, it is a three millimeter. So there you go. Go ahead and snap that loose. We're gonna go ahead and fully remove this because like the uh, Royale, we will have to use it to line up the barrel later. So just to show you, the barrel will slide right on out now. The good thing about the Wildcat barrel is it has a flat spot right here so that the set screw will always align properly on it. There we can see this, oh here let me move it up in the camera. Here we can see the scar from that single set screw. So we're going to go ahead and slide this back in. Whenever you do there's no notch on the bottom so you have to align this properly in order to make sure the transfer port's lined up. So we're going to slide that back in. Make sure it doesn't stick into the action because it has a different style magazine. And I can see the scarring from the set screw. So we'll actually for the Wildcat what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and take our 4mm. We're going to tighten this screw down right here. And not tight tight, just enough so that's pressing on the barrel on that flat spot I showed you. So that I can keep it in line. And now we're going to take our set, our single set screw here with our three millimeter Allen, and we're going to go ahead and bomb this out. Torque it down a little bit, make sure it's nice and tight. And again, that's three millimeter. Uh, now the barrel won't move and it's lined up right. And then we're just going to once again three millimeter, put the cheek piece back on. You don't have to over tighten these screws, just, just lightly hand tighten, make sure they're nice and snug, they're not going to go anywhere, and there you go, there's your Wildcat, thanks for watching. 